everyone. Welcome to our channel. Today I'm here with my mom today and we are going to do our um, Dooney and Burke NFL collection video. We've been wanting to do this video for a very long time and for one reason or another we haven't been able to do it but it has been a very requested video and uh, since my daughter and I both are Dooney and Burke lovers and we both have our little um, NFL collection, we decided we wanted to share that with you today. And I'll let her start. Let me introduce her first to some of my friends that um, have known me a while. I know you haven't seen me in a long time. I've been MIA, but I'm back and hopefully I'll be able to do some videos um, a lot more often. And, but I wanted to introduce you to my daughter. This is my daughter, Chantel Gonzalez. Hi, and she has her own channel, so I'd love for you to go and check it out. It's, she's a handbag, lo handbag lover like me. <laughs> and um, I guess it's hereditary, because my mom, which is sitting right over there, <laughs> likes bags too. Well, maybe one day we'll get her to share some of her beautiful bags. I'll let her start. Okay, my collection is a lot smaller than my mom's. But we're just going to go ahead and take turns. I'm going to start with, let's start with one of my favorite and newer pieces that I just received. It is the Dooney & Burke cosmetic case. And it's just like this. And it's very small, but it fits a ton. That's what it looks like inside. And that is my first piece. Very cute. I don't have that piece. So yeah, she started it. with a small piece. Oh, where's my little small piece? This is actually a new acquisition that I just purchased off of uh, QVC. And I don't remember what I paid for it, but it is uh, uh, as is. And there was absolutely nothing wrong with it. It was a lot less than retail. And I'm sure even if you get on uh, I Love Dooney or something, you can get it for a good deal. It's called Dooney and Burke NFL Broncos Large Slim Wristlet. And it's nice because it'll fit. I don't have my phone with me, but I have an 8, an iPhone 8 Plus, and this fits perfectly. Let me bring it up to the camera so you can see. It's got this little wristlet. You can take this off and hook it onto this side and make it, you know, carry it this way. It actually fits quite a bit. You know, nowadays when you go into the NFL football games, they don't let you carry big bags. So unless you have a clear bag or I'll show you another bag that I've been carrying to the games and it's been permitted and I absolutely love it because it's kind of like a wallet on chain. Well, not on chain, but a wallet on strap, and it's been working really good for me. But this is another option, and this is the inside. It's the traditional red with a slip pocket right here. You can slip in your phone, some cash, your ID, and it works pretty good if you like, you know, small, small items. But Perfect this is for the game. Yeah, this is really good. So this is the first piece, and that's allowed in the game too. Yeah. They're really strict with their uh, with their bags now. You can't just take whatever in there. Since my mom wanted to show hers, I'm going to go ahead and pull mine out. This is the same thing. I got it a few weeks or a week or two before she got hers. And it came in this little package. See? Yeah, that's how mine was, was as is. Was? And I haven't if you even look really on looked there, at it. I mean, you can really look for some good deals because... I guess some people order them and they see them and they're not as big as they thought they were going to be, so they send them back. There's mine. And it's just in pristine condition as my mom's. Very cute. Yeah, those are I really like cute. that. Really cute. Okay, back to you. Back to me. Now, this is the one that I've been carrying here lately. And let me, I'm going to. I should have had she this ready. She wore this ready. one to the Giant game last year. I should have had this ready to go because I know I have, well, I lied to you because I don't have the name of it. Usually, I never get rid of my, um, 
my tag so I can tell, you know, so I can know what it's called. And it's not in here, but anyway. Um, this is basically a wallet, and it's a pretty good size wallet. Full size wallet. Full size. And then it's got the red interior. You look inside, and it's got, let me see how many. It's got two pockets right here. It's got a pocket right here, big slip pocket, another big slip pocket. And then, wow, another slip pocket. It's got three of them. And then a big compartment right here. And then it has one, two, three, six credit card compartments right in there. I don't know, I hope you can see this okay. And then the zip compartment right here. And then on the other side, it has two more big pockets. And then a big compartment here. And then more credit card slots in here. Six more. So you got a total of 12 credit card compartments and one, two, three, four, five slip compartments with the two big compartments. So it's got like an accordion style right here. And I guess it would come like, depending on your team colors, this one's orange. And then it's got a zip pocket in the back, which also comes in pretty handy for coins. I don't, I don't usually do coins because I don't like my bag is getting dirty. I try to take care of them as much as I can. And, um, but it's there if you want it. My phone, again, fits easily in here. And then in here, I'll usually put in a lip product, maybe a compact or, you know, whatever you want to carry, something small like that. Your tickets can go in here. And then of course your ID and debit cards or credit card, whatever. It's got two little snap deals here, so if you end up stuffing it a little bit more, you can use the other snap and it'll work better for you. This is, it's got an adjustable long strap, again, according to your team colors. This one's orange. Yeah. And I love it because you can literally take these off if you want when you're not using it for something like that and use this as a wallet in your bigger bags. Um, I haven't done that, but you can do that. And when you crossbody it, should I show? Let me show you real quick. Well, I don't know if I'm too. This is how it looks if you just carry it like this. And then if you crossbody it, it fits right here. Mm -hmm. And it's just the perfect size for game day. They won't, yeah. they don't tell you a thing for this size. And it works absolutely perfect and you're cute while you're at it. Yeah, I so. honestly think that one's more ideal than using this one since it doesn't come with a longer strap. This is as long as it goes. So it just kind of stays right under your armpit just like that. Or you can keep it like as a wristlet. But at a game, you don't want to be holding on to your bag the entire time. So when my mom used this one for the at the Giants game, like it was, it was perfect. It was perfect. Crossbody the entire game. You're not everything. everything. You're not having to hold it and take care of it, and it carries everything you need plus your phone, which is great because you don't want to drop your phone or whatever. And, mm -hmm. But you always want to have it with you. So yeah. anyway, next. All right, I am gonna go ahead and show you guys my favorite crossbody and it is the small crossbody they have two different sizes of crossbodies and this is a smaller one and i absolutely love it it has this really nice slide in pocket here and this one's the one that i used whenever we went to that game and then you open it here and what i like about it is that it has this really beautiful uh tassel and then you slide that open and it's just like a huge deep pocket. Nice. It's just this, yeah, it goes all the way down. That's where I kept my, like, my heavier stuff in there. I kept that in there and it, it is um, outlined in red as well. And then it has this as well, this big pocket right here. And it has six 
uh, card slots in there as well. You can kind of see right here. And it just looks like that in there. And I, I really like this. I enjoyed it. I kept my power bank in there and my wallet and stuff like that. I always take my power bank with me oh, whenever yeah. we go to the games. And Gotta it was perfect that. to have that in here. And it just has the really beautiful leather strap. It's not orange, but it matches the tassel. Like the Sierra. I think that's the Sierra leather. I really like it. I like that dark. Dark that brown. Dark brown. So that's what that one looks like. That one's really nice because it's, yeah. let's compare it to this one in size. Um, it's just a little bit bigger than it or taller than it. Mm -hmm. And... Well, this it's one's really a wallet. Skinny. Yeah, this, this one's, one's skinny, but it, it extends and you can mm -hmm. actually put like big stuff in there if you need to. Yeah, so it, I really like really, this. Really good. I'll probably continue to use this one to the games. I really wanted to get this one for the games, but I feel like it's too small for everything that I want to carry to the game. So I'll continue to take this one. This one's a really good one. And it, they allowed it to into the game so you have to think about that when we bought it we just wanted all the entire collection and we just wanted a little bit of everything but we had to really consider stuff that we were going to be able to take into the games and this one's definitely one that goes into it that they allow yes all right, all right. now we're going to go into the little bigger bags this is the very first bag that i got i got a lot of stuff on it right now but I don't normally have all this stuff on it, but right now I have this little orange poof, and then I have a bracelet that I just keep on there because I usually wear it during game day. This is a little, I don't know, what is this called? Like a keychain, key fob deal with a football and a little helmet that says Dooney and Burke for a TV. And it's navy blue, so it's very appropriate for my team colors. This is the very first bag that I got. It's the Zip Zip Satchel in the Denver Broncos, of course. And uh, has a beautiful Sierra uh, strap with the whip stitching on it, which I think gives it a lot of character. It's got feet on the bottom, which is really good because um, you don't want to be laying it on the ground. Oh, got a little scratch on it. And um, anyway, I don't know. I've never tried to use this to the game because, you know, I always use the smaller mm -hmm. ones. I think I just carry this on game day. Um, it's very pretty. It's small. It's kind of like a medium size. It's not too big, not too small. And if you're familiar with a zip zip satchel, they open wide all the way down. They do come with a crossbody strap. A lot of people don't like this strap because it's the very thin one. And it kind of, you know, hurts on your shoulder there. But it's there if you want it. And then, but it's really, 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 really big. It opens up very big. Opens up big. Here's a accordion right there. And then it's got the traditional red inside. It's got a zipper compartment here. A big slip pocket here, which is where I usually put my phone. And then there's two pockets here. There's one right here and uh, another one right there. So this is another one. This has got the, the key fob thing right here that I never used to use, but I started using and I would clamp my keys on there and they're so much easier to find that way. So um, anyway, this is another one of mine if you're if you like the zip zip satchel it does come in the nfl collection so if you're interested in that that's also available yeah that's awesome okay and then i am gonna show my very last smaller one and this is the one that that i got oh, for cute. christmas from my mom um i was so in love with her wallet on a chain so she went ahead and got me the wallet, and I love, love, love the wallet. And you, as you can see, I haven't even used it yet. But it has this really nice zipper back here. That's cute. Yes, I love it. Love it, love it. And then this is what the inside looks like. It has plenty, plenty, plenty of space. In the inside, it is outlined in the red, as you can see there. 
and it's just that beautiful brown inside. I really like this. I will be using it this season. That's really cute. It's not too yeah. big. Mm -hmm. That's kind of like a medium sized wallet. And this is my wallet, and then this one is my mom's wallet on a chain. A so wallet on the strap. See, or wallet on, oh yeah, <laughs> wallet on a strap. There you go, you can see that difference. Yeah. That's very cute. Yeah, very cute. I, I like, really like that. It. Mm -hmm. And I really like that Sierra trimming up against this. Mm -hmm. We haven't brought that up or mentioned it, but, um, or I don't think we did unless you said something about it. But this is a canvas material, okay? This is the canvas, which is nice because it just wipes clean and yes. nothing happens to it. So, it, and it's durable. It lasts forever and ever. I'm going to reach back here and I'm going to reach for my big tote. This is my big, big tote. It's probably, I don't know, it's a medium size. It's not very, very big, but it's um, got some long, thin straps and the Sierra leather. And then it's got the brass logo here that all of our bags so far have had. Big zip. This one doesn't have like a big... Um, Strap. I guess I should have emptied these so before. Much room. But look at how much room this has. I mean, it's mm -hmm. humongous and it's zippered, so it that's very nice too. It's got the the little tag here that says Dooney and Burke. Your zipper, and this one's got the thing in it. Let me see what it says. Bronco Zip Top Shopper is what that's called if you're interested in that i'm sure these are i'm sure all of these are still available yeah. um i haven't even looked but i'm sure there's new stuff i'm trying not to there look is because you know we're going to want to add to it okay here's another slip pocket which of course is my favorite for my phone and then two slip pockets back here on the other side and, a key and, fob, right? and then the key fob which is again very very handy I never thought I would love, but I do. So this is really, really nice. It's nothing on the back, feet on the bottom, and um, it's very, very nice. Let me show you the comparison in size. Um, here's this one, and here's this one. So it is a little bit bigger. I know for a fact that this would not be allowed at the football games. Oh, but yeah. This is way too big. But this is good for going to Denver and just throwing in your water bottle and throwing in all your goodies. And, yep. Um, you know, and then, of course, you can put this wallet inside of it. And then, which is what I did the last time, I think. I put this in here and then carried it, used this back um, for my trip to Denver. This is a great travel bag. And then I use this every time I wanted to get out and I didn't want to use this big one. Yep. But you're still in style, you still look cute, and you're still, um, you know, you got what you need, everything you need to carry with you. Yeah, okay. I think that's a really good way. Okay, I, whenever my mom bought her satchel, I bought the hobo bag. And I love this bag. This is my favorite, obviously. It's the, the biggest one, but I really, really, really like this bag. It's really, really, really pretty. It's It has that beautiful strap, that darker, darker brown strap. It is adjustable. I haven't needed to adjust it in any way. It's just like that. It does have feet. I love that. And then, that one's really cute. Yeah, it fits perfect right here on my shoulder. Stand up and show a little. I really like that one because it, it curves right where your arm ends right here. Yes. So you mm -hmm. it doesn't interfere with your arm. See how it just yep, goes down right down. there. Perfect. Yep. Perfect size. Perfect, perfect size. size. I think that my mom would really enjoy this one. Yeah. And I think these you can adjust. Mm -hmm. They're very hard to adjust, but they do adjust. And I think most of the time they're set on the perfect 
yeah. perfect little I notch there because I, I have one similar, not a Bronco one, but And we keep one. them stuffed, all of our bags. That's yeah. why it looks like we have all kinds of stuff in it, but it's just stuffing. We like to keep our our girls nice and stuffed and... Mm -hmm. oh. Oh, I haven't even, I've used this bag a ton, but mine comes with the key fob. There's that. And then there's the interior. It has the red interior. It says Dooney and Burke. And then we have the, you see the big pocket? Yep, my mom's favorite pocket. I call it the flat pocket because it's just a huge pocket and you can just flap it closed just like that. That one's great for your phone. Mm -hmm. That's my mom's favorite pocket for phones. Huge, it has a nice zipper pocket. And then on the other side, it has two large divided pockets. And I like to keep like my pins or something, just something that is gonna stand there and it isn't gonna be moving back and forth all over the bottom of my bag, leaking on my bag, anything like that. That's what I like to keep in there, but those pockets are very big and They're deep. very big and deep. Mm -hmm. Actually, I think I could probably put my cosmetic case in one of those. Yep. Yeah. So it, it's pretty big. Yeah. So that's the interior of yeah. that one. And that's my hobo. That's very cute. Yeah. Alright. Hey, that's it for all the Bronco uh Bags. The Dooney and Burke bags. But we well, do, I do no, have three other Dooney and Burke bags that I brought that I used to use before they did the Denver Bronco, the NFL collection in the Dooney and Burke. I used to use these bags and they're just the team colors. And But since I brought them, I'll go ahead and share them with you. This is called the Willa Satchel and it is very, very nice. It's That's like beautiful. a medium size. This is in the persimmon color. And I'm gonna try to slip this one back into my car in a minute because my mom's already wanting it. Yeah, she wants to keep that one. She here. said that one's not leaving my house. <laughs> okay, this is this has got a huge, whoa, yeah. huge strap. Oh, that thin one that not everybody really likes, but let me show you how huge this bag is. This is huge big big bag zipper here my favorite slip pocket this still smells new mm. and then it's got the two slip pockets in the back right there and what i really like about this bag is it's got these two not hidden compartments but they're off to the side there's another one goes all the way to the bottom of the bag the same thing with this other side, another big pocket. So you're actually looking at one, two, and three. And I won't go into too much detail with these because, of course, this is an NFL collection. I feel like these aren't part of the collection. But there are other options that you can use, like if you don't have one of those. I don't know if they would let this one in the yeah, stadium. No, Probably this one not. Is too big. It's too big. Yeah. And, and they are very strict. They will they, leave. They'll make they'll you go back, you back to your car, and they'll it's bad because when we go to the games, we Uber over there. So I mean, we can't go back to our car. We would have to go back all the way to our hotel to leave our bag. Yeah, so. not good. No. This is another one. This one I picked up at Marshalls for a great deal. It, it's originally one eighty eight. And I picked it up for $59, $60. It was really good. And this one, I believe, would let, they would let you bring in, I think. I don't know. That one's it's a big. little, it's a little long, but I think it, I think it will. I'm not really sure of the dimensions, but there's a big compartment there. And then it's got the same two slip pockets. Sorry, I wish I could show you more of the inside, but it doesn't open very wide. Um, same little tag here, zipper compartment, phone compartment, the Sierra trimming with the whip stitching on the zipper pull, adjustable thin strap. This one has no feet. And this one has a great pocket right here in the front, deep all the way to the bottom where you can slip in a phone or 
something and it's got the the brass Jimmy and Burke logo that he loved and it's trimmed down here at the bottom in Sierra Sierra leather mm -hmm. so before we finish this video up I'm gonna go with this last bag that um, used to be my very first Bronco bag or I would call it my Denver yeah. Bronco bag it doesn't up against this orange it's not like very orange but it really is orange yeah. and um, it's got the red interior this one's an older bag that's a cute bag but it's very the only thing I probably don't like very much is the handles are really like hard and even though I hung them up on the doorknob for a long time it they don't really straighten up that much but it's okay I love it because it's nylon and it'll stuff very very good I can stuff it to the rim it's got the uh, the leather Dooney and Burke logo right there the braided handles and then it's got some little braided little deals here at the end with the brass hardware and this one has no zipper on the top, but it has like a like a snap snap button right here. The only problem that I've had with this bag, and that, you know, we're here to tell you the pros and cons of these bags, and that way, if you're interested, you know what you're getting. Um, the only problem with this bag is that it does. Um, it did get color transfer um, when we went when we won the Super Bowl this last time and we went up to the um, parade I used this bag and uh, I filled it up and carried it with me I had blue jeans on it's January it wasn't even um, the summer it was that hot it was freezing in Denver yeah it was really cold and I had blue all over the bag I was able to get it all out um, which was very good and maybe because I cleaned it like immediately but you do got to be really careful with it because it will transfer this one again has no feet at the bottom so but anyway this I guess I don't know do you have any more bags or no that's, that's it? all I have that concludes this collection um, of our NFL bags and again if you're a big football fan and I know we've got what like a month and a half to uh, look forward to the new season yeah. um, if you're a big football fan these are some great options some great choices whether you go to the game or whether you just dress up at home and want to look cute and want a matching bag for your outfit these I would really really recommend these bags yeah. they're great and they're durable I don't know how long I guess we started getting ours as soon as they started selling them because, of course, we had baseball ones first and then, um, what else? Baseball? And, and college. And the college they ones. College the ones college well. collection. And um, as soon as they said they were doing the NFL, we jumped on it because yes, we're we did. big NFL yeah. fans. So that was really great. Yeah. And I'm sure when they bring out the new ones, which I'm trying not to look, um, we're going to want to snag another one. Yes. And if we do, we'll come back and share it with you. Yes, they have a lot of styles. You have different, and they don't just have this um, this uh, logo right here. They have, um, different, they have ones. different ones. They have different styles. It's not just one like with just the logos all over it, anything like that. They have different ones and some with helmets and stuff like that. They're really cute. So go ahead and check those out. Those are You can find them on cute. Uh, the Dooney and Burke site, mm -hmm. or you can go to I Love Dooney. I know that they always have maybe, maybe not all of them, but like one or two on sale. Mm -hmm. And um, get on Ebates, get on Ebates if you have that. If you don't, get on it and get on there. You'll save some money. Um, Macy's, you can find them at Macy's or anywhere they sell Dooney and Burke. They pretty much have the NFL collection. So, um, if you look on there, you might find something you like and you, you know, go ahead and snag it before it's gone. I know I want to get a little bit more before they're gone because I feel like once they're gone, they're going to be really hard to get. Yeah. And, and I really do want to add to 
to, you know, maybe some more small, small uh, wallets or little coin pouches or I want a cosmetic bag and I really oh, like I'm her wallet, so I might get love. that. Yeah. yeah, really cute. Yeah. Is there anything else you want to share? No, 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 no. She covered it. Thank you guys very much for watching. Thank you. And um, go to my daughter's channel. It's Chantal Gonzalez. Is that what, it, what is it called? It's under Chantel, it's C-H-A-N-T-A-L, and then XOXO is what I'm under. And we'll go ahead and link, link it down, it down below. below so that you yeah. can uh, get on there and check out her videos. She just started her channel, so she started doing some um, bag videos. She's a big handbag lover like me, so um, I'm sure you'll find something there that she likes, and I think she's gonna, that you'll like, and she's branching out to, like, doing some beauty videos, and makeup, and makeup, and cheek videos, hauls. yeah, so it'll be fun, and hopefully you'll see me a lot more, because I'm gonna try to, um, make the time to get on here and share some of my new goodies that I've gotten, um, I have been watching your videos, but I just haven't had time to do some of my own, but, I am ready to start doing them, so you'll see yeah. me too. So anyway, <laughs> have a good um, night. Yes, have the, a good night. We, we got this done before the sun went down. We got yeah. out of work and we were trying to do it really <laughs> fast, so I'm glad we got it done. Yes, thank you guys for watching. Thank you for watching. Bye. And if you haven't subscribed, this is the time to do it, guys. <laughs> Subscribe. We'll link everything down in the description box below for Yay. you Yay. And go Broncos. Yay. Go Broncos. Bye. Where do we look at? That right here on this little, this little dock. Hi everyone. Hi everyone! Welcome, Welcome to, to our, our channel. channel. <laughs> no.